Um, anything more specific in terms of maybe what animals can, uh, what animal signs will, will do well this year uh, or, or not do well this year? Okay, in terms of the zodiac sign, those who are born in the years of the monkey, the rooster, wow, well, congratulations. In this year, the year of the golden bull year, they will be doing very well in terms of their wealth creation, wealth accumulation, right? Especially the rooster, the monkey, even the rats also very good. The tiger will also be having a lot of good opportunities in this year as well. So there'll be a lot of noble people, a lot of other people, supporters to help them, to lead, lead them or to guide them in terms of their wealth creation, in terms of their wealth accumulation. You see, sometimes, right, the wealth can be created. How the wealth can be accumulated, uh, that is also very important. For example, some of the houses, uh, maybe uh, the staircase face to the, to the main door, uh, even though maybe during that year, they will be having a lot of good opportunity for wealth creation. However, in terms of the wealth accumulation, maybe that may not be that good because the qi are uh, flowing from all the way from the staircase to the main door. Uh, this is actually one of the things uh, that may cause the losses in wealth as well. And uh, besides that, those born in the years of the uh, uh, snake and also the, the, the pig or the boar, in this year, in order to I mean, get more wealth, they should uh, take the opportunity to maybe to always be in touch with uh, their friends and relatives from our station, from overseas. Or uh, right now to move around, I think after entering to August or, or after uh, May, people can be more freely to travel around, I believe. So during that time, especially uh, in this year for the snake and also the bowl, they should take the opportunity maybe to travel a little bit or to be in touch with their friends and relatives from overseas, from our station, so that they will become their noble people. Uh, in terms of the Chinese philosophy, in terms of the Feng Shui philosophy, the noble people are very important. When we are having noble, noble people or the supporter or the helpers, right, to help us, then we can achieve the status of do less, gain more, or no need to do too much, then also still can benefit from a lot of things. So the, the snake and also the bull will be having this kind of uh, very interesting, I mean, the... Uh, uh, situation for wealth creation. However, on the other hand, right, those born in the year of the bull or the ox and also the uh, the goat and horse, maybe will be facing a bit of hiccup, a little bit of so-called challenges in terms of wealth creation. So in order to uh, so-called to have better wealth accumulation or wealth creation, they have to identify their own, I mean, uh, the, the noble people. For example, in this year, so I mentioned this one, those who are having greater wealth creation or greater wealth accumulation are those one in the year of the monkey, the rooster, even the tiger, and also even the dog actually not bad. Uh, they should be always in touch with them. Uh, that means uh, to, to tap into their positive chi so that uh, there will be some uh, so-called uh, good positive overflow to them. Then they can attach the positive chi um, from this kind of journey. So those born in the year of the, uh, the bull, the goat and the horse, even though they could be some of the challenges in this year, however, don't worry. Just avoid making any major decision, especially in the months of July, October, and January 2022 will be good. So it doesn't mean that the whole year round will be very challenging. Uh, only these few particular months, they need to be extra careful only. Whereas the dragon actually is considered not bad as well. And the rats is considered very good in this year. However, they need to take care a little bit in terms of their health. So the health also need to be taken extra care for those born in the year of the horse as well. So uh, the rabbit uh, also need to lay low, uh, stay put a little bit. So don't make any major decision in this year. Should they need to invest heavily, it's better to consult someone, get an expert, get at least an investment expert who are more knowledgeable than them. So they can consult them, get them, uh, get some advice, some, some feedback from them before they jump to conclusion. Uh, basically, these are the group of the uh, so-called the Jordan uh, 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 in terms of the wealth uh, related. Okay, thank you very much, Master Kenny. Thank you very much, and I would like to take this opportunity to wish everyone good wealth, good health, and good feng shui. Kung si pa chai to everyone. Fantastic.